Hell yes, Human off the forthcoming album, Undeniable. It's on 98.9 The Rock, Kansas City's Rock Fest Station. Those guys, of course, going to be on the uh, Worth Harley Davidson stage this evening, headlining that at 8.50. And joining me right now, Tom Cat. Yes. Tom Maxwell, how you doing, buddy? Great. Kyle from, uh, from uh, Hell Yeah. Uh, gr- congratulations on the forthcoming album. Oh, thank you, man. Now, thank you guys it, for having us back out here this year. I, I'm trying to think the last time I saw you guys, like how long it's been. It's been a couple few years. Has but, it? Yeah, I, I, mean, I've, I know... All these shows sometimes start getting they blended do. together, you know, whether that's out here at Rockfest or, like, you know, at the Midland or whatever. Yeah. But uh, I know that with the new album you got, you went the crowdsource funding route on that. Didn't you do that? No, no, no. Isn't that, you don't know? No, I, no, no. I, I thought we, no, well, we, we we're no. doing, doing, well, our management had an idea to give uh, our fans a more personal experience okay. by, by doing, a, like, a... What is that thing that go oh, like thing? a pledge? Like a pledge yeah. thing. Right, right. And, and it was pretty much they would pledge ahead of time. Ahead of time, yeah. and they would get stuff from us. Right, right. Now our the the record was done through the big bank. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, because I just I know that like you see you see this sort of happening because especially with more established bands, yeah. I, I feel like you've already got that connection with the uh, with the crowd yeah. and the audience. Yeah. They know what to expect from you. Yeah. So, yeah. And, and I think from what I've read and what I've seen, you guys are really really taking it to a harder level we yeah we're we're really involved with our fan base I yeah mean, we get a we you know ever since especially the last record when we did the no more campaign with you know our song hush and stuff it yeah. really you know a lot of people connected to that man it was crazy how the people came out in droves and just like wow you yeah know? i mean that 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 song especially i mean yeah. it's such a heavy topic yeah. you know? a lot of a lot of people with and and i mean you know we you know, we're a hard rock station sort of thing you know but, yeah. but i mean when that song would play i would get so many calls and yeah. so many text messages like this song resonates with me it really is helping me yeah you know and i then, mean it was it was a, a song that just happened it wasn't like it was we have to have a slow song on their album it sure kind of developed and right and at first, I was super nervous to show Chad that song. You know, well, like, yeah, I mean, it's you're exposing a lot of yourself. You well, know, and, well, musically, I thought it, I, I thought it was like, all right, should I give it to the band or should we do Shania Twain? <laughs> right, <laughs> right, right. <laughs> and Chad loved it, so right. Yeah. Well, it, it, obviously, it, it did really well. The yeah. audience loved it. You know, you got this new album coming out, and you and you you guys are super busy as always. I mean, you're, I think uh, you're doing the Rock on the Range, right? The, yeah, the first time, first. man. First. I no. Oh, good time. Vinny's returning to Columbus, which and is a big step for him. Yeah, I mean, and, and, and he's he all right? Is he good? Is he, he solid? Is, is he was, in a good headspace? His space? idea, man. It was was his it idea. really? Oh, yeah. Our jaws he dropped. Just, and we're yeah, I, was, I, I, I thought I was dreaming. Yeah. I had to take a second take on that because, uh, you know, we get asked to do that every year. Yeah. And, you know, obvious for reasons, he just didn't feel like it was ready. But now he, he says it's about time, right? Feels wow. It's, time. We're, it's gonna be a special day. It's yeah, be absolutely, awesome, absolutely, it's gonna be absolutely really awesome. That's so. I mean, I'm getting chills just thinking about it. You know, you know, because like. Yeah, I mean that's that is a pretty heavy deal. So, yeah. well, wow, man, it, uh, break a leg this evening. I know you guys. Well, don't say that. I broke my leg last year. Oh, <laughs> now, uh, uh, y'all, dude, check this out. It's a true story. Right before I left, I meant metaphorically speaking, yeah, I meant the exactly. way that, you know. I know. <laughs> well, but right before we left for Europe, my neighbor, yeah, his name is Stu, and he looks at me. He goes, "Hey, you know, break a leg on tour." I'm like, "All right, thanks, man." I literally the first show in Munich, I yeah. shattered my ankle to pieces. Well, how about kick some ass yeah, tonight, man? Yeah. Yeah. So no more break a leg. Yeah, no more, so no more break a leg. Just, just kick, me, kick some ass tonight, <laughs> man. Kick some ass Dude, tonight. Thank you for having us again, man. Absolutely. Can't wait to play. Yeah, looking forward to seeing you guys tonight. Once again, 8.50 on yeah. that Worth Harley Davidson stage. Yeah, Hell yeah, headlining that over there. Yeah. Thank you guys again. Pleasure. Kick some ass. Yes, kick some ass. I will. <laughs> <laughs> have a good day.